and people are at the shore soaking up the sun and what they can. The sun now, uh, well, it's kind of gone here from the view in North Wildwood. Lauren Casey. We ap appreciate the uh, gorgeous weekend you've had on tap for us. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the sun is set, but gone. that's okay. It was <laughs> gone. It was there earlier. It's gone now. We're going to see tons of sunshine down the shore tomorrow. It's going to be an absolutely gorgeous beach day, but we do have an elevated risk of dangerous rip currents, so do keep that in mind. We'll take a closer look at that, but today, certainly a toasty one, 87 degrees. Our normal high temperature is now 78 degrees, and we started off warm this morning with a low almost near 70 degrees, and we're still in the 80s in the city. We're at 80 in Dover, 75 degrees right now in AC, 77 in Allentown. A warm night in the Poconos. Temperatures right now in the middle 70s. And as we head into the overnight period, we eventually will drop down into the 60s. Our temperatures will drop pretty quickly once that frontal boundary drops in overnight tonight. After it passes, humidity starts to decrease. Breeze kicks up, mostly clear skies. So coming through without a lot of fanfare precipitation wise. And yeah, the countdown to fall is on, of course. The Eagles game tomorrow, four days away from the official start to the fall season, 43 days away till Halloween, and 68 days away from Thanksgiving, the best holiday, in my opinion. As we look at our forecast for tomorrow, sunshine and very low humidity, almost feeling crisp, but our high temperature will still climb up to 80 degrees above average. Just a gorgeous day in store. Sunshine all throughout the day tomorrow with those temperatures warming into the 70s by the 11 o'clock hour and then hanging in the upper 70s throughout the afternoon with that nice breeze out of the north and down the shore. Check this forecast out. Beautiful. High temperatures humping in the mid to upper 70s tomorrow. Abundant sunshine takes us through the day, but we do have that elevated risk of rip currents high through this evening. And then looks like we'll scale back to moderate potentially for tomorrow, but still need to be very careful. Always swim in front of a lifeguard if you do enter the surf. This elevated rip current risk because of post tropical storm now Odette. And it's continuing to move out into the North Atlantic. So, over the next couple of days, things will quiet down at the coast as Odette is not going to be an issue for us. But by the campfire, maybe you have the next week off and you're spending it in the Poconos. It's going to be really nice tomorrow evening. Temperatures in the 70s, eventually falling down into the upper 50s overnight. And your seven day forecast looking pretty nice over the next several days. Humidity creeps back in as we head into Tuesday. Wednesday is our active day. Showers and thunderstorms looking likely. For the first official start to fall at 3:20 in the afternoon, but after a cold front sweeps through, much much drier air arrives and cooler as well. Check out our high temperature on Thursday, 71 degrees. We could have a high only in the 60s by Friday. That will be our first high in the 60s, Joe, since June. Wow. All right, Lauren. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.